ഓം വക്രതുണ്ട മഹാകായ സൂര്യകോടി സമപ്രഭ നിർവിഘ്നം കുറുമേ ദേവ സർവകാരേഷു സർവത സദാശിവസമാൻമാം ശങ്കരാചാര്യമധ്യമാം അസ്മദാചാര്യപര്യന്തേ ഗുരുപരം വരാം സമസ്തജനകല്യാണീ നിരതം കരുണാമയം നമാമ്യ ചിന്മയം ദേവം സദ്ഗുരും ബ്രഹ്മവിദ്വരം വസുദേവസുതം ദേവം കംസചാതൂരമർദ്ദനം ദേവകീ പരമാനന്ദം കൃഷ്ണം വന്ദേ ജഗദ്ഗുരു how to lead a successful life this is not given in mahabharata mahabharata it is given as vidura reeti this title is given by us if we say vidura reeti we will not come to class <laughs> let vidura explain this in detail dhridrashtra why should i come and learn this vidura so, taught this knowledge to dhridrashtra can get some tips ideas how to lead successfully okay that's it and if you don't like this topic i will give one more topic if you like this topic ancient wisdom for modern real life real life success okay we are living in modern life. even though the ancient is very relevant to all of our scriptures have you heard uh, all of you have coffee ഭഗവാൻ വേദവ്യാസ് വ്യാസായ വിഷ്ണു രൂപായ വ്യാസരൂപായ വിഷ്ണുവേ നമോ വൈ ബ്രഹ്മണുവേ വാസിഷ്ഠായ നമോ നമ ഭഗവാൻ വേദവ്യാസ് founder of sanatana dharma we can say founder of sanatana dharma so he compiled all the vedas not composed he compiled the difference between composed and compiled composed means it is coming from our intellect compiled already exists in vedas the veda mantras he collected and compiled and he has given the name rigya jo samatra veda all are mantras <coughs> so we have to sit under teacher we have to learn the mantra we have to understand the meaning of the mantra it will take hundred janmas for us to understand the vedic essence <coughs> why we are all buddhas particularly na kaliyuga manda manda bhagya vipudrata so it is in bhagavad so we, we don't have that much power to grasp the idea of vedas bhagavan veda vyas understood The compassionate as compassionate mother he has to give the, the essence of vedas to us that in a sweet way you cannot give very the dry papada you should be like uh, a boli you call it boli or boli you know that sweet obert huh? obert obert sweet okay <laughs> not dry in the sweet way you have to supply vedic ideas he took vedic ideas and presented through story so that to mega story so we call it mahabharata actually it is mahabharata very big story of pandavas and kauravas 
this is if you if you read mahabharata you can understand why hey, all every part is looking like it's happening in my own house <laughs> all the episodes are from my chitapa parima my uncle so it's looking like my own story is happening here our own story is expressed in mahabharata so this is a fight between two brothers the son what you call it very much at the bar big uncle and small uncle uncle also and the sita also and the uncle dhritarashtra putra and pandu putra both of the brothers dear brothers the same blend son of dhritarashtra so dhritarashtra son of pandu so conflict between these two people Dhritarashtra putras, hundred people, Pandu putra, five hundred Pandavas. The family conflicts, and that leads to Mahabharata, Purushetra, Bhar. One by one, we will see. Family, family problem. Mahabharata is not Itihas. I hear that we should not use the word mythology or mythology. No, Itihas. Why the name is Itihas is given to Mahabharata? Itihas. It happened like this. Happened like this. How do you know? There are so many archaeological uh, evidences there, right? and so many facts you find in the scriptures of the ancient scriptures also. You find the episodes of Mahabharata, Ramayana, very old episode. In Tamil Nadu, two thousand five hundred year old episode. Yeah. The book is called Silapadiga, <coughs> Tamil text. You find the information of Mahabharata, Ramayana in that. So this is all the subjective evidence and objective evidence. Objective evidence are here as outside you are getting subjective from the um, what do you call the text? Okay, it happened like that. So we are living here. We are living here after hundred years. We do not have any trace in this world. Do you agree with me? Why hundred years? Just ten years after our death, they, they will wash out everything from the oh, oh. after fifty years. No, after hundred years, no trace, no see. Five thousand years back, they lived. Still, we are talking about the Satya, the Hasa. Okay, Dhritarashtra, Gandhari, very nice father and mother. Very nice father and mother. They brought up hundred children. Very nice children. The first one is Duryodhana, Dushyasana, all dur dur dur. Hundred names, hundred children. So these two people brought up hundred children. Don't need to send these people to school. School itself, they started school is the home itself. Dhritarashtra okay. and Gandhari. So their children are hundred Kauravas. Hundred people are called Kauravas, the Pancha Pandas. Okay. You like the photos? <coughs> yeah. This is not yagya. This is like little movie. Okay, semi movie. You can screen also you see the picture. So whenever it's needed, I will also dance and act. Okay. <laughs> so you feel that you are watching movie. So this is conflict between hundred Kauravas and the Pancha Pandavas. We know the story. I am not going very deep into the story. In the beginning, they went to school. When they were in the school, <coughs> Kripacharya taught. Primary school was taken care of, care by uh, Kripacharya. Higher school. Kudrona sir, very good. Great student. See how to cooperate like that. <laughs> so, Kripacharya and Drona sir. And they were studying. When they were studying, Bhima is a very powerful person. Duryodhana did not like Bhima. They started the problem. In the school itself, Bhima is so powerful. All the hundred Kauravas used to climb the mango tree to pluck the mangoes. Bhima will climb. Bhima will climb the tree. And you shake the tree <laughs> to get the mango. Along with the mango, all the hundred people will fall. Top, top, top. So these hundred people will go to father. And they will. They used to. What do you call it? Complain. The father also. Pretty hard. Huh? This boy did like this. Bhima. They started the problem. The children' problem. Parents should not take seriously the child's problem. It's very big. So lesson we have to learn. 
Because today they will fight, tomorrow they will put their, on their shoulder, their hands and they will walk. Dhridharashtra taken this very seriously, he also contributed. Dhridharashtra also went behind the undercheck. Particularly Duryodhana did not like Bhima. The Brahmana went very seriously. Duryodhana gave poison to Bhima and he pushed Bhima to Ganga. Very great sin he started while he was studying in school itself. Duryodhana. This is poison part, okay? The part of poison is there. I know you are thinking what is there in the part. It's not the pickle part. <laughs> <laughs> poison part. And next, he just fired them in the wax house, planned in such a way, that sending these people to Varanas, Var Varanavata, the Himalayas, and set fire, finish all the Pandavas. They escaped from the fire house, third. And they called and they uh, played what is that? False gambling. After the false gambling, they disrobed or humiliated Draupadi. False gambling. See the gambling Mahabharata. Twenty times they played. Twenty times. All the time this fellow Shakuni. Shakuni only played the game. Our Yudhishthira never got once in his hand. Twenty times. What kind of game? Yudhishthira never got any chance to roll this dice. Twenty times. False gambling. So in the gambling they made agreement that if you win the game, okay, we will go to forest for 12 years and we will spend one year hiding somewhere in the city or town. If you come and hide, uh, find, find us, again we will go to forest for 12 years and 13th, 13th year we will hide. In the same way, if we win the game, you have to go to forest for 12 years. 13th year you have to hide somewhere. He will come and touch you or find you. Again, you will go to the forest for 12 years. 13th year will hide. Again, he will come and find you to the hide and seek. In the same way, you keep, you keep on living in the forest, you keep on living in the palace. So, this is the <laughs> agreement. This agreement made by this 100 people Duryodhana, Dushasana. Big gang was there. Duryodhana, Dushasana, Karna. Hmm? All these people. And they made this kind of agreement. Yeah, according to the story or the karma, this our Panja Pandavas, the heroes got failed in the gambling and they went to the forest. Twelve years they outlived the forest. It is Ramayana Mahabharata, they are going to forest, I do not know. On <laughs> the two Idihasas, forest life is unavoidable. So we also sometimes we say you go to forest after 50 years, why the house itself is looking like forest totally. <laughs> no need to find animals in the forest. So what do you mean? I don't mean anything. <laughs> oh, why should I go to forest? The home itself is forest totally. Brindavan. Now what is only one of What is the name of the home? So no need, no need to go to forest. These people went to forest for 12 years. You have to live literally. You should not take anything. No kitchen uh, things. No servants you have to take. You have to go alone. Live the first 12 years. 13th year you have to hide somewhere in the city or town. Hiding yourself. If we come and find you, again you have to go to 12 years. What kind of agreement? Very successfully our people finished the Pandavas. After finishing this, if you come back, then we, you will get half of the property. This agreement. They finished very successfully. Then Krishna and Pandavas, all their friends, they came together, they had meeting and they sent one Brahmana to uh, Asina. So according to the agreement we have finished, you have to give half of our property. We are not asking uh, uh, the Pitru Paitama, the traditional property. Our father also contributed to this existing property. So he did Dikvidri, our Panda, uh, Pandu. So our father's property also, we have all the right to take half of the property. And Duryodhana says, I will not give. 
So Duryodhan says very interesting. You take five uh, pin pins, okay? What do you call? Gundu si. What do you call Gundu si? Pin what? Gundu pin. Pin pin point, okay? You take five pins together and put it there on the ground. How many how much area you get? The tip of the pin, okay? That much area land also I will not give. Uh, he says that. Suchya. Suchya means pin. So that much he land also will not give. Then everything goes very seriously. This fellow is very adamant. Now we have given. Sama is over. Dana is over. Sama, Dana, Bed also. So now Danda we have to take. So the Brahmana went and went as messenger and he told. Came back and told Pandavas. This is what he says. Again from here, Sanjaya went there. Dhrudrashtra is telling Sanjaya. Sanjaya will go uh, see the condition of <coughs> or the mental the sthiti of Pandava. Sanjaya went and Sanjaya understood. Definitely they are going to beat all of your hundred children are going to die in the battlefield. Sanjaya came back. And he says, <coughs> Sir, Dhrudrashtra, sir, tomorrow in the, the hall I will tell you all the things, what are the things they have told me. I guess the midnight, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, he came back. <laughs> so he, he wants to have more time. I am very tired, but you are in very dangerous condition. You be careful. Only a small amount of message only, you just give. And he went and slept, our Sanjaya. Because the way he expressed something dangerous thing is going on, I think everything will be finished now. Your hundred children are going to die. This much enough to not to get sleep in the night. <laughs> Our Dhridharashna did not get sleep on that night. Okay, this is what happened. So at that night, Dhridharashna asked Vidura, please ask Vidura to come and meet me. Vidura comes in the, in the night time. If you are not having any sleep, you are disturbing my sleep on this. <laughs> Some people are like that now. Oh. If they don't get sleep, if they are disturbing other people also. You switch up the light and you read. So when you switch up the light, how can I read? Okay. When you switch on the light, I cannot sleep. Are you getting it? Dhridharashtra did not get sleep. So please ask Vidura to come and meet. So I have to have some conversation with Vidura. Vidura! Vidura, who is this Vidura? Vidura is none other than his own brother. Because three brothers together they took birth. The elder person is Dhridharashtra, second one is Pandu, third one is Vidura. Vidura is a very great person. He is the avatar purusha of Yamadharma Raj. Because of some curse he has taken this avatar Vidura. Dharmika Purusha. Always speaks Dharma. We also have some family member like this. Always Dharma only. And that will be very irritating for us. <laughs> Always there. Hey, you should. You want to get up early morning. You want to do puja. Hey, you should. You should learn some stotra. Hmm? Every Friday, you have to go to temple. <laughs> you should have someone in our home. Every day, every one hour, every other, you should give instruction. That is called dharma. He do not like this kind of instruction. Vidura used to give this kind of instruction. Particularly to Duryodhana. They see the condition of Duryodhana. Whenever Chitapa comes up, he comes down. <laughs> or what? To give some advice. We do not like any advice from any. We know it. Be careful. Ride the car very slowly. Mm, I know. <laughs> Always the parents. Right? Be careful. Walk slowly. You, I know. <laughs> Keep your documents very carefully. Small, small things you are giving up. What? This condition of our Vidura, he used to give all kinds of Pakka, very great personality. Very sadhik personality. Okay? So this person, called by Udhradrasya, Old night, Dhridrasa, sorry, conversation. 
like how Arjuna and Krishna had conversation Bhagavad Gita and said. Very beautiful thing. Final, finally, he says, after the, resigning all the advice, midnight, okay? <laughs> two, two hours, three hours, after listening everything, finally he says one statement. Very beautiful statement, you will like it. You will laugh at that statement. What is that? Last day only I will tell you. <laughs> Come here. Last day I will tell you. After listening, three hours, I am sitting and giving you lecture three hours. After listening this, you are telling like this. Before itself, you should have told like I should have gone for my sleep, okay? You disturb my sleep, I am listening this, you are telling. What kind of state you are, statement you are telling? Finally, you will see that. Okay, now, see, is, now, they are getting ready for Kurukshetra. Before Kurukshetra was that night, Vidura came and Vidura was giving uh, advice. Okay? Dhridhara Ashwani Vidura. Dhridhara is a very nice person. Dhridhara is a very oscillating kind of point. He supports dharma, he supports adharma, supports dharma, adharma, dharma, adharma. Finally, it will come and stand adharma's point. Very interesting personality. Very tamasic personality of blind person. Unstable. Now, before going into our Vidura Niti, small thoughts we have to say. Then we will get into Vidura Niti. Ahara Nidra Bhayamaitu Namcha Samani Vedatu Pashudut Naranam Jnanam Hitesha Madhiko Visesha Jnane Mehina Pashubiki Samana. This is a very popular sloka, you must have heard. Very popular sloka. Four things are very common for a human being and animal. Ahara, Nidra, Bhaya Maitura. Ahara, food, death. Nidra, sleep. Bhaya, fear. Maitura, reproduction system. All the four things are equal to human and animal. Samanya Maitura, Pashu, Bihir, Narana, Nrana, Pashu and Mrita. Uh, uh, Nara. The Pashu is horizontal. This is the dog is horizontal. The man is vertical. All the four things are horizontal here. All the four things should be in the hierarchy. The jnanam should be in the top level. For the animal, jnanam, all the things, whether it is knowledge, belly, or heart, or emotions, everything is in the horizontal level. For the human, the jnanam should be in the top. Therefore, the head kept in the top. Jnanam narana madhigya visesha. Jnani na hi na pashubihi saman. If man, if man doesn't have this knowledge, then he is equal to Pashu. Pashu means in Tamil, Pasubad. In Sanskrit, Pashu means any animal is called Pashu. Okay? Pashu is equal to... Uh, so, Jnana is price. Knowledge is price. For that only this shloka, okay? So, when, only if you read the shloka, it's getting bored. Therefore, it brought the small, small pictures. But now you see, this is board, you see the picture, okay? <laughs> get entertained, get a revival. <laughs> because only slow guys get bored. And then, and then the color also I have given, okay? You don't know why this color is given. Because that is highlighted. Okay? Now, Pandita Lakshana. Now our uh, Vidura is starting this message, advice. First is giving. Pandita Lagu is called Pandita, scholar. The wise man. Okay? We will check ourselves also. Whether we belong to this category or not. Okay? Pandita. Who is called Pandita? He is going to give so many strokas, very nice information. Now, Shri Bhagavan Vashe, second chapter of Bhagavad Gita. Okay? Asochan and Vasochastom, Prajna Vadam Sevasha Se, Gadasuna Gadasuncha, Nam Sochanti. Pandita ha. This word Pandita is used in second chapter of Bhagavad Gita. Bhagavan Adi Shankaracharya gives the meaning for Pandita. Panda Atma Vishaya. Atma Vishaya is called Panda Buddhi. The person who has got Buddhi, Natma Vishaya, Natma Jnana, he is called Jnana. Pandita ha. Pandita means not scholar according to second chapter of Bhagavad Gita. In Gita, Pandita means Chitta Pajna or Jnana. Is it okay? Because we are all very familiar with Bhagavad Gita, therefore I brought this idea. Is it okay? Excuse me? Yes. Shall I move forward? Yes. Hmm? Yeah. Ah, Pandita. 
Because here we are going to see again and again Pandita. When we listen to Pandita from Vidurani, we definitely will get that this Pandita is different from that Pandita, or that Pandita, or this Pandita, same Pandita. Definitely will get. So this is a different Pandita in second chapter. Tita Pajna or Jnana. Now, this Pandita, man of wisdom and wise man. Okay? So Gurudev used to call this Tita Pajna as man of wisdom. Man of wisdom is common. Wise man, most same one thing. What is the difference between wise man and man of wisdom? Both are same. Yes, both are same one thing. A small difference is there. <coughs> now see. In Paramarthikam and Devaharikam. Paramarthikam means spiritual standpoint. Devaharik, worldly standpoint. Okay? The worldly standpoint, the Pandita means the man of success. The Paramarthika, the spiritual stand, the man of wisdom is called uh, Siddha Prajna. So his aim is to get liberation. But the wise man's aim is to get success. Are you getting it? Now we are going to study about the person, the person name is called the Pandita, whose sole aim is to get success in the Devaharika Stiti. So in the second chapter it is discussed, the man of wisdom or the Pandita is discussed, his aim is to get liberation. Why? Spiritual standpoint. Or again the difference between two Pandit? Excuse me? Yes. So that pundit needs liberation, this pundit needs success. That is Paramanthi. Uh, you got the difference, okay. Now, our focus is not to get liberation here. <coughs> so we have come here today, tomorrow also will come, I know. For this four days, our topic is how to get success. Do you want liberation? <laughs> not now. <laughs> <laughs> Today I went to one place, a Biksha. So one person asked me, Sir, we are very happy with all the dance, music, this and that, puja. I am living very happy life. Why you ask me to get liberation? Actually, I didn't say anything. <laughs> I didn't say that you have to get liberation. He himself said. Why you are asking me to get success? First of all, I didn't say that you ought to get liberation. I will not say. Unless you ask some question, I will not. As I said, if you are very happy with the dance, music, this and that, enjoy it. Liberation is not meant for you. If you are getting bored, if you don't like anything, then if you come and ask me what next, then I will tell you. Sit up right here. Now you go to liberation. Dharma Artha Kaam. As long as we enjoy this game of uh, the change, our game of life, when we enjoy, so we are not getting bored. <coughs> when we get bored, then we ask that what next? Then we have to work for liberation, moksha. Okay, so, so here, man of wisdom or paramarthikam, liberation is not our topic. So our topic is success. We are level. We are all the slokas, whatever we are going to study. It's going to focus no. on the practical life. Are you getting it? Now, this introduction is there. Now, Dhiradharasho Vach. So, we are going to focus on our intellectual uh, capability or skill to understand what is success. <coughs> At present, we don't want liberation. I am very happy with my family. If you, if you speak about liberation, tomorrow I will not come. <laughs> if you speak about success, I will continue. Okay, so we are going to discuss about success. So what kind of the knowledge we, sh we should have to get success, that's the point. Okay. This is what we are going to get in four days. Now see, everybody is blessed with some skill and some talent. Like, agree with me? Agree. You know how to ride a car. If everybody is very good in riding a car in America. So riding in America is very difficult. I, I sit next to our people. Because same speed it goes. Like sometimes you feel... But the same, the fluctuation should be there. 
question <laughs> to get sleep. <laughs> because Sanjaya came and Sanjaya disturbed his sleep. Okay, just you tell me something. After listening everything, then you will tell the last day and tell what he says. Then Arjuna told Sandeha, Gada Sandeha, Stithosvi, Gada Sandeha, Karishya Vachanantar, I will follow your instruction. Krishna, our Arjuna told, now here our Dhridharashtra will tell the last day. Now Dhridharashtra is asking, hey Vidura, please tell me something. I want to hear from you. No, Vidurashtra asks, okay? And there are so many things Vidura says, that, sir. I edited and I brought main sloka for you, okay? Vidura says, first of all, you are not a good person. This is how he starts. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't bring all the slogans. First of all, what kind of person you are? And Vidura says, I asked you to tell me good thing. <laughs> you are scoping at me. Because you are not a nice person. You are supporting Duryodhana, Dushyasana, Karana, Shakuri. That is not right. So Pandavas are Dharma Purushas. You are not supporting them. Even though you are not supporting them, you are supporting your own sons and relatives. Your path is not right because you ask something. I will tell something, okay? okay. Now I will start. You will listen to me. This, this is how he starts. Very bold person. He is not afraid of anything. Only his duty in this life to tell the truth openly. Whoever it may be in front of you. Whether it is Krishna or the, the Dhridharashtra or uh, Pandu or Pudhishthira, whoever it may be. If you ask me, I will tell you the truth. He says. Now he says. From this, what the sloka onwards, the things uh, we are going to see the Vidura uh, Deep. There are eight chapters. Right? Very big book. Eight chapters. But we select the sloka. If you read this, then you can continue in your life. Okay? Atma Jnana Samara Baha Titiksha Dharma Nityata Yam Artha Nava Karishanti Savai Pandita Uchade. Can you repeat? The slow one by one I will tell you, okay? Because you are not participating, you are sitting very silently. Okay? Yeah, Atma Jnana. I am not going to sing like Bhagavad Gita. Atma Jnana Samara Baha. I am not singing. Simply. <laughs> Atma Jnanam Samarambha Itiksha Dharma Nityata Yamartha Napakarshanti Savai Pandita Uchchate He is called the Pandita or scholar or wise man. Who is that? Atma Jnanam Samarambha Itiksha Dharma Nityata Yam Artha Napakarshanti who has got five values? This English translation we don't see, okay? Because we have so much of gap there, only, therefore I brought this. <laughs> the English translation, many books I have seen, is not very really satisfying. Because gap should be the gap is so much, therefore I filled up the gap with the self stuff. That's it. You keep the English a second. The main one is the main sloka, is it? Atma Jnana, every person should understand about himself. So in this sloka, Atma Jnana means not the self-knowledge which is mentioned in the Upanishad and Bhagavad Gita. Okay? Here in this context, Atma Jnana means knowing about ourselves. Our weakness, our strength, knowing as it is. Okay? Without any bias, we have to know our weakness, our strength. Atma Jnana, knowing about ourselves. Samarambha, the activity. Samarambha is word used many times in Bhagavad Gita. Samaram, whatever the project you are taking, Samarambha. Titiksha, we should know about ourselves and we should uh, act or we should take up some project in our life. Simply we should not sit, eat, sleep, sit, no. We take up some project, do something. Know about yourself and do your activity. Titiksha, at that time you should have the Titiksha. Titiksha is word. Use no Vedan Sukha Dukkha Eshu Sagishnatto. So you have to bear Sukha Dukkha Lava Nashta Sita Ushna Tidiksha. What do you call it? Four times. Four times. Simple, simple things you should not get irritated. Simple, simple sound is irritated. 
particularly the mosquito comes boy <laughs> slowly boy <laughs> one mosquito we won't bring hammer <laughs> something <laughs> half an hour we are fighting like kurk shetra wala <laughs> Irritate, small small things is getting, we are getting it. Titiksha, we have that feeling of getting irritated very quickly. Titiksha, and dharma nityana, so we have to avoid the dharma. Knowing dharma and following dharma, knowing about ourselves, and we have to start some project. While we are starting some project, we should have titiksha. Once it yam artha adhana avakarshanti, we should not deviate from our project, our duty. Once we start, we have to finish it. The person who has got all the five qualities is called the Pandita. So now you can check yourself. Atma Jnana Maram, 50% mark. Samaramba, I am not uh, taking anything, project day starts. <coughs> And asking me to do that project. My karma, I have to finish it. So, Samaramba 100%. <coughs> Why someone is starting the project? Atma Jnana 50 percent Diksha, so minus 2 percent Diksha. Dharma Nityata, okay. I am Dharmic Purusha, 80 percent Mara. Yam Artha Artha Napa Karishanti. Also, we do, we do not deviate from there. You can under any circumstances. Yes, why? If I deviate, I have to go to India. <laughs> Survivor. I have to do it. Okay, under the compulsion we are doing. But this, is, this should come from inside. All our dharma, nityata, all our this kind of advice should come from inside. But many times, why we are following the, all the values? Pressure from outside. Why you are coming to the office on time? Karma. <laughs> Right. If you are in India, you are not coming on That is our motherland. Mother understands. She gives freedom. <laughs> to go to other place. Okay. The external, because of the external pressure, we are following the dharma. That is not dharma. We don't like that kind of dharma. Pressure gives dharma. All the dharma should come from, from the conviction we follow. That is called that. Okay. We, we, we like it and we follow it. So the, the Pandita should have all the five qualities. The, the sloka looks very simple. Sloka looks, looks as all the five qualities. Just I, we take only Atma Jnana. Okay? We leave other thing. Atma Jnana means knowing about ourselves. Now we honestly tell me. We think about ourselves more than it. Please sit there. People are telling, say, say, whatever you are doing, you are not, you are starting, you are not finishing the thing. In your work, there is imperfection. If somebody points out, we will not accept it. Do you agree with me? Accept it. <laughs> somebody says, that. sir, in your project, the perfection is not there. Oh, what perfection? I have given all the accounts. Sir, the account is not tallied. Oh, 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 oh how to tally? <laughs> I have given the paper. So paper size. Oh, what paper size? They have given this paper size. Well. See how you are talking. Huh? If I talk, then you are telling something. If I don't talk, you are telling some other thing. What is this? If somebody says something, what is that? Uh, some complaint, you will not uh, accept it. You agree with me? You don't like it. Are you getting it? If somebody praises, you are right. So you are perfect. Hmm? Ah, ah, ah. One more time, I want to hear that. You are great. Huh? Oh. When somebody praises, we like it. When somebody says something imperfect, then. Sir, Atma Jnanam, we think ourselves more than what we are. You agree with me? That's our problem. Otherwise, in other category kind of person, they are very good, but always they think they are, they are not, they are, they are nothing. 
the helmet is right here. Some people are there. They are very good. But they are like, oh, not like that. So they think that if you put myself very low, then I am egoless. I am great sadhaka. Are you getting my point? Am I coming right here? One category, they have everything but they put themselves down. Other category, nothing is there but they think I am everything. <laughs> Okay. Atma Jnana means because of this judging capacity about ourself is not there. Therefore, we are suffering in many fields. When we get this one, among the five qualities, what one quality I know about myself. This I cannot do. This I can do. Because this is my ability. All my physical strength I know. My mental strength I know. My intellectual ability I know. This is what I cannot compare with other person. Other persons uh, or the creation is different. My creation is different. God created me in this way. I know what are things I have. I know what are things I do not have. As it is to be understand, then we will not compare ourselves with the other person. We will not get any jealousy, no inferiority complex, no... What is that? Uh, inferiority complex? Superiority complex. We will live as it is. Are you getting it? This person is called Pandita. See the knowledge. Very interesting. Word. Only one quality. Knowing about ourselves as it is. Pandita Uchchati. You got the point? But most of the time the person thinks is more about himself. It is not there inside. That creates problem in his field. Then, what to do? <laughs> what to do means? We have to sit in a quiet place and we have to analyze about ourselves. Then we will correct. This is not a reflection. Then only we will get the maturity that through the reflection we come to know about ourselves. This is called Atma Jnana. Knowing about ourselves. Are you okay? Shall we go to the next slide? Yes. Next slide, okay? Yes. Nishayvate Prashastini Prashastani Nimbitani Nasevate Anastikaha Shraddhadana Yetat Pandita Lakshanam Yetat Pandita Lakshanam Yetat Pandita Lakshanam Scholar or a wise man. Nishevate Prasastani. The characteristics of scholars to follow and imbibe good qualities. Prasastani means prasasyam, that means um, it is to be praised, it is to be worshipped. The real, the literal meaning, prasastani. That, that which is good. Nishevate. What is good? This person will follow what is good. Prasastani Nishevate. Ninditani na sevate. What all people are Ninditha means they are. Uh, uh, the evil deeds are very. Uh, the translation is not right, that's why I told you. Ninditha means scolding, generally. Uh, it is to be abundant. It is to be abundant by all the people. It's called Ninditha. You getting it? But here translates abundant. The evil, the evil deeds is not the right to translation of Ninditha. But this is a minimum translation we got there for this. You keep it second. Always the translation keep it second. First important go to. Nindita, what is whatever is to be uh, abundant. Okay? Na sevate. He will not. Ninditani na sevate. Prasastani sevate. Good thing is to be followed, bad thing is to be abundant. Anastika. He is not nastika. So he has got astika buddhi. There is some power in this world beyond our intellect. Anastika shraddha dana. He has got a shraddha. Because nastika will not have shraddha. Um, anastika. Anastika means astika. Astika will have this kind of shraddha. There is some supreme power in this world. Astika power. And I can understand that. 
keeping that in his mind, he does all the good things, he is for the dropping or renouncing all the bad things. This person is called Pandita. Good things to be done, bad things to be rejected. But in our life, we will take, we do not know whether it is good or bad, we do it first thing. If people start scolding us, then we will leave it. So before itself, we have to identify. This is good or bad. Good thing, do it. Bad thing, just leave it. Have faith in the Supreme. Have faith. Sraddha dana anarthika. Yedat pandita lakshad. See, it looks very simple, simple value. But when we come to our practical life, we miss so many simple things. The simple. Gurudev says that perfection is not a simple thing, but simple thing makes perfect. You are getting a small, small point. So, part is very big. In the part we have milk, okay? The small, what do you call it? The whole, small hole in the part. More than enough to drain all the milk from the part. There is no need to have any big hole. Small. Pour the milk, after half an hour we come and see what the part is there, where is milk? Krishna Jayanti, Krishna would have. <laughs> we have the whole interpretation. It's a small gap in the same day. Small, small mental adjustment we do not have, we don't understand, therefore we are losing so many things in our life. Even though we are very good, highly talented, highly skillful, small things, something we are missing somewhere. Okay, the supreme power, I have Shraddha, what is good to be, what is bad to be renounced. Kurodo, Harshascha, Harpascha, Tri, Stambho, Manya Manita, Yamartan, Napakarshanti, Savai Pankita Uchade. The man not attracted or en enchanted by anger, fear, ego, shame, notoriety. The spelling is okay? Yes. Notoriety or notoriety? Superiority complex is called. <coughs> no, see. Kuroda. Kuroda means anger. Harsha. Excessive shame. Always excessive. So there should be limit also when we enjoy it, when we enjoy something, there should be limit. Not always jumping. <laughs> Some people have got that point of habit, jumping. Always. No. Harsha. Um, enjoying something, we should have this limitation of uh, no, sorry, limitation. We should express in a limited way. Are you getting my idea? Krodha should not be there. Arsha means cheer. There is no wrong in having cheer. But too much. Oh, you understood, okay. Krodha, Arsha, Darpa. Darpa means ego. Kri. Kri means what is not to be done. When we do that, then it creates a shame. Stambaha. Stamba means showing ourselves always high. The stamba only we are uh, hoisting the flag with it. Always hoisting the flag. Wherever the high places we will go and sit there. Who asked you to go there? Nobody. Then why you went there? Nobody told there, therefore I went there. Why? Simply. I am to be noted by everyone. Manya Manita, superiority. Always when the person walks, when he talks, we can understand from his expression, he always brings superiority. The superiority complex, superiority, an ego, this kind of shameless act. Okay? So, Hanges is going on the stage and doing something, he is not feeling any shame. Huh? If you ask for something, you are getting angry, what is there? All this bad quality, artha napakarshanti. The person, the person, uh, person 
is not attracted or enchanted by all this bad quality. This person is called Pandita. He may have all the good, great uh, capacity, but one with me, just to leave all the other qualities, Manya, Manita, Stamba, Arsha, Darpa, leave everything. Only one point, Kurodha. And the person is a sharp tempered. The person is sharp tempered. Okay. Is doing something on the stage. For example, say, only I am telling you. Just in that, on the stage. You decorated so well all the ornaments. All very nice dress. People are sitting there. Hundreds of people. The person is doing something there. Okay. You came on the stage and asked something. When you asked something, the person reacted on the stage. Okay. And what kind of feel you are getting there? Not that way. Did I ask, did I ask something wrong? Just particular thing. People are standing, sitting there. Some kind of concept. You are the coordinator of the program. You are the director of the program. You decorated very well. <laughs> mm. <laughs> on the stage. You asked something. That person reacted on the stage in front of all the people, camera also watching. Then you were very highly educated. You also hold some high post in the company, but you are reacting like this, what is this? Will you ask or not? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so what kind of the feeling we get like, in front of all the people, you react like this? Short temper. What did I ask? A small thing or this, suddenly you also get angry. Small thing I asked you were telling this, what is, you are the camera, ah, camera close up. <laughs> Suddenly you are also get angry. You become so angry. Kurodascha, only one quality, the bad quality is bringing out this man completely down to the end. The fallen soul, on the stage. Sir, you have to control your anger, on the stage people are watching you, camera is on you. Are getting it? Pandita Lakshan. I am not asking all the people, taking all the people, Daripa, Manya, the ego is not different. Comes, suddenly it comes. Short tempered. <coughs> the person who is not having control on his anger, the public, then he gets into the problem. He is not Pandita. So this person is not attracted, deviated by this anger. Again I am telling you, only one quality only I am telling you. Simple, so he is called Pandit. If he is deviated from this um, nice quality, getting short tempered, he is not Pandit. Are you okay? Yes. And you say he is very nice person. Whenever we discuss the, the Bopanda, he is very nice person, great singer, great dancer, great writer. Great for the, the technical person. Everything is great. Only one thing. Sharp tempered. <laughs> is that it? Are you getting it? All the things he is having, only sharp tempered. When he used to get temper, everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. And that one quality brings us down. Pandita Uchate. Because we, we develop opposite. Only one skill will take so many years to develop, like only one skill. You have all the skills. So many years we are spending to bring all the skills. One negative value brings us down from all the things. Here Vidura says, the person has got all the things, then he is not Pandita. If it's, the person is not deviated from this negative, it's called Pandita. This is a very nice look. Shall I do this? Okay, I am not giving very big, big, elaborate commentary and small, small commentary only, okay? There so many slokas. We will cover many things. Yasya Krityam Na Janamdi Mantram Va Mantritam Pare Krita Me Vasya 
ஜானந்தி சபை பண்டித உச்சதே மந்திரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்ரிதம்
How many times we have, we heard that? My story, this person has produced as a movie and he earned so much of money. Right? Therefore, if you are the Pandita, don't discuss this kind of high class idea with anyone. Do you agree with this point? Yes. All other slokas we know. This slokas we appreciate. This is good. Okay. Before execution, you should not release <coughs> that person is called Pandita. Any, anything. Before buying the land, before getting this, before getting this, you should not discuss. If you discuss with your own, I am telling you in the family now, the particular Indian family, very great people. <laughs> Whatever you say, hey, this is the most secret, okay? Like Brahma Jnana. Most secret, just you are very close to me, I discuss with you. Don't tell anyone. How oh, okay, okay, tell them. Everything you tell me. After receiving everything, this person is not getting sleep like the rest. <laughs> Indian mind, I have seen, who discuss anything. This is Indian mind of not keep going. They will go for sleep. They will not get sleep. Again, they will not get sleep. The secret they have in their mind is not allowing them to sleep. What to do? You have to share this with your close friend. No, my night midnight to love her. Are you awake? <laughs> I am going to tell you something. This is what we discussed with me. Please don't discuss with me. <laughs> okay. Now, the boiling ideas went away. The person who received Tolo plan. All people are sleeping there. Hey, get up. Hey, hey, don't disturb. Secret. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next day morning, the person who spoke this secret is receiving the message. <laughs> and what's the group? <laughs> <laughs> So whenever we get, receive something, we do not have the ability to keep it secret. And the curiosity, I want to share it. So that kind of quality is, um, everybody has got that kind of quality. If you get something very special, first I want to share this with the other people. In the group. Before someone is sharing, I want to share it. I want to get that credit. Have you got that message? I want to share it. First you have to share it. Then they, oh my God, what a great message you sent me. Oh. Yes, a kritya me janandi. Mantram ma mantri nampar. So when you discuss, when you have that idea, you should not. Okay? That person is called the Pandita. Otherwise, your idea is someone is taking, then they make it, they commercialize And they made money. Because your idea. You can, there you should not show the general, it's my idea, anybody can take and you can grow. Sir, you are not Pandita. But in the practical life, you have to keep the secret. You can, there you should not bring the generous sir. Generosity. Take all of the idea you take and you grow. They will make money. That money is used for some other purpose. As a Pandita, before, so you should, we should have control over our tongue. That is the point. Control over tongue is called Pandita. It is very difficult, right? It is very difficult because mental pressure is so much. When somebody says this is a secret, don't tell me. First, I have to tell some, someone, then only I will get sleep. So this is called <laughs> Pandita. Very nice token, very nice point. Okay? Yasya Krityam Na Vigyananti Shita Mushnam Bhayam Ratihi Samurdhira Samurdhirva Samai Pandita Ucchate Again, almost the same kind of the thought, same kind of words also. 
यस्य कृत्यम न विज्ञनंति शीतम उष्णम वयोवृति समृद्धि असमृद्धि यस्य कृत्यम द एक्शंस आर नॉट इंटरप्रेटेड बाय हीट कोल्ड नेदर फियर आर लस्ट व्हेन यू डू समथिंग व्हेन यू व्हेन एग्जीक्यूट समथिंग इट इज नॉट डिस्टर्बड बाय शीत उष्ण भयम रति रति मींस नॉट ओनली लस्ट सो एंजॉयिंग लाइफ द एंजॉयमेंट शुड नॉट डिस्टर्ब द एग्जीक्यूशन fear should not um, suppose i do i project i bring the project so what this will or tell what this will the fear should not be there and what uh, about um, rati means all kinds of rati drinking dancing all those things okay that's called rati not only the spirit the translation is written lust is direct translation fear rat bhayam rati sitam ushnam these things samruddhi asamruddhi samruddhi richness and power all these things should not affect our project so before uh, revealing the project the secret should not go out okay the project what we have in our mind we should not release before execution the idea we have to keep in our mind secret should be maintained first point next when we execute at that time all the things may affect the project these things should not affect should not disturb it it has to go because of the climatic condition because of the climatic condition outside inside inside climatic condition bhayam rati outside climatic condition sita ushna he should not disturb the project it has to go work has to go that's all we should not stop it when the work is going without disturbed by this thing that man who has taken this kind of work is called pandita okay i stop the work because of snow fall i stop the work because of excessive heat two years were telling like that totally what to do before that corona for years <laughs> sir you are not poor you are always telling some reason i am afraid of this person if i start this person may come and scold me therefore okay rati so everything is okay nobody is scolding corona is gone the climate condition also okay now i went for some other purpose rati boating boating rafting all the things is okay rati all this external things you should not have to project when you start something you have to continue that if you have that ability then that person is called pandita the man of execution okay yata shakti chikirshanti yata shakti chikirshanti yata shakti cha kurvate yata shakti cha kurvate nakinchit dava manyante nakinchit dava manyante nara pandita buddhaya nara pandita buddhaya yata shakti chikirshanti the learned man pandita learned one or wise person okay deep in the wisdom know their limitation eta shakti chikirshanti eta shakti they we know our uh, ability according to our ability we have some idea we execute eta shakti chakurvanti according to our limitation we have to uh, keep some goal chikirsha means we have to uh, like or having goal chikirsha so we have the capacity to buy one dollar second and one dollar okay that much money only need. not you i <laughs> i have money to get one dollar second and one dollar what does okay this middle class car yes our bills <laughs> Tesla is middle class. <laughs> Second Tesla, Honda is okay. Okay, I have money. How much money? I want to get a Honda second. How much money I should have? Ten k. Ten ten thousand dollars. Okay. So I have ten thousand dollars. I want to get a Honda. Ah, okay. I have ten thousand dollars. I can get a Honda car, okay? But having ten thousand dollars, I am aiming at Tesla. 
Shakti Chikir Shakti means whatever you have ability, according to that you have to have uh, your desire also. That's the point. But I have little money. I have a uh, thousand uh, what the dollars. What do you want? Bensika. <laughs> you are going. Sure. So what do you want? I'll be able to. They will explain all the things. This is new thing, new digital system. What's this? Cast, cast. How much the cast, cast? 50,000 dollars. So 50,000 dollars? I have only 1,000 dollars. <laughs> this person spent more than 15 minutes. I'm showing everything, explaining everything. <laughs> Do you call this person Pandita? <laughs> what will be the reaction of that salesman? <laughs> okay. Luckily he knows only English, he knows Tamil. This <laughs> desire. <laughs> we have a separate dictionary <laughs> to scold it. Eh? Yata Shakti Chikirshna, do you understand now? We have very little but uh, aiming for something higher. There is no wrong in it. We have no our capability. This is what I can do, that's all. With this money I can buy this car, this house, this land. There are too much. Yata Shakti Chikirshna, Yata Shakti Chakurvate. According to our, our capability, we have to do the work. Our ability is very small. We aim for big. And that person is called fool. Not Pandita. What is possible within their power and work for the same? So within the power, and he is not what that. Um, for them, no effort, however small, is below their degree. He he understands that this is my capacity, this is my the ability to buy and ability to do. More than that I cannot do. And I am not insulting anyone. I, I understand what, what is my ability. That this person is called Pandita. Okay? And many times what happens that we, you know, more than that our capacity, we buy something and we get loan. People are giving loan free then get it. Then will I give it back? <laughs> you will enjoy the life. Then after that, I will take everything from you. Then finally, what will you do? One plate I will give you. <laughs> One cup I will give you. <laughs> Why you have come to this condition? Yata shakti chikir shanti yata shakti na sevate. Therefore, I have come to this level. Too much. So we say in, the, in Tamil, I don't know how to say in English, small sparrow, you put big fruit on small sparrow's head. Chittukuri is the This is what we say in Tamil, a nice phrase. Chittukuri means sparrow. Panambar means what? Palm fruit. But I don't find any palm fruit in America. Watermelon. Is it there? Watermelon. Water instead, of, <laughs> instead of palm fruit, we take watermelon. Okay. So putting watermelon on the head of spare, what will happen to spare? Don't spare. So many times, a great thing in our life, according to your ability, you buy, you do reaction. This is the message. So what happens in our life, we know our ability, we cannot buy this, we cannot do this. But most of the time we compare ourselves with someone. Do you agree with me? Mm -hmm. uh, the opposite person, opposite house, the person has got new car. Next day itself, I sell the old car. I book the new car. It takes a six month. <laughs> but my opposite person is my competitor. Opposite person is breaking his house. 
Now what you are going to do? Last month only you did house warming. We get it. If you take a <laughs> joke, if you take everybody has got somebody has their competitor, and this man is living because of that person. We get it. Whether in, the, in our own family or in the office, somebody is my competitor. What is the purpose of your existence? <laughs> Because of that fellow. <laughs> because of that, not only I am living like this. If you get some, uh, if you join it, why not the course? Huh? You didn't tell me. I will also come and join. <laughs> you got that certificate. Ah, I will also get certificate. Otherwise, I will print the certificate. I'll... <laughs> Whatever you do, I have to do it. Whether I have capacity or not. The first thing from our mind, when we take up this competitive uh, the mood, what do you call competitive attitude? Attitude, uh, attitude. attitude. Sir, this is your life, your ability. According to your ability, you leave. Don't look at anybody. I how to become like this. This person is more than me. This person that is is their capacity. They can do. I cannot do that, sir. Whatever ability I have, that is more than enough. Thank you, Lord. Why? I do not have the ability to dance. Thank you. <laughs> if I want, if I walk, that itself is looking like that. Many people do. That itself is more than enough, Lord. Thank you, my Lord. Okay. When you speak, it is looking like the same thing. Ah, that is more than enough. Getting it? So this is the amount of the power. He just kept in us for the physical strength or mental strength. It is the power. Don't need to compare with the other person or get into problem. Mostly we compare with the other person and we try to raise our personality, which is impossible, and we get into past work problem. Here Vidura says, Yata shakti chiki shakti. Yata shakti chakurva. You desire according to your capacity, you do according to your capacity. Don't insult everyone, don't compare with anyone. If you live in this way, you are called pundit, scholar, wise man. What a great relief you will get there when you do not compare with other person. Sir, this person here is old, 80 person, 80 year old man, sir. Eighty-year-old man, he went to somewhere else and he came with forty-year-old man. We are amazed. Hey! Who? I went to this place I Eighty-year-old man went and came forty-year-old. Forty-year-old. We went, we came eighty-year-old. <laughs> eighty-year-old. Something wrong. Sir, don't compare with this. Meant for them. We are not meant for them. That's all. <coughs> you getting it? Yeah. According to our capacity, we live in this world. Happy. That's all. The comparative idea when we draw okay, with anyone will be a reality. 90% of the happiness peace comes. He looks like this, he is having this much intelligence. I do not have any water intelligence we have that is more than. If you read more, you will not get sleep. I tell you. I'm not, therefore, I'm not reading anything. Very good. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> so, when we, whenever we meet some intelligent person, you say, what a great day, I do not have anything. Simply, suddenly we get there. Eh, I am okay. This is what I get. He memorizes so many slokas. I do not memorize anything. My mind is empty. I am very comfortable. Very relaxed. No stress in this. If you memorize, then you will forget everything. Again, to remind all the things, you have to get stress. I am free. Leave it. When I look at this book, I can read it. When I close, everything will be closed. <laughs> I am very happy. Leave it here. Okay. This is called Yata Shakti. According to your Shakti, you will live in this world. Nobody is asking, no. The Lord is not asking that. Why? Krishna Janma Ashtami, you are not memorizing any shloka, you are not. 
You project here, ask me to read, I will read. If you sing, I will sing. If you close it up, I will go to my home. That's all. <laughs> Why you are behaved like this? Yata Shakti, these are told. According to our ability with this, no need to come back. But one person, so the jogging then, we call it jogging. If you walk in walking, jogging, slowly you run. Slowly. Half hand, you just. Man. Before you are another person, was jogging. Then, <laughs> this person is that. Before this person, another person is boy. Suddenly, this person is overtook the first person. First person got hurt. <laughs> Not <either. laughs> He overtook me. The first person started moving faster than the second person. The second person started moving like this, okay? The second person went to his home. The first person started moving to chase the second person. First person landed at second person's home. <laughs> second person reached his home. First person asking, this is which area? <laughs> Sir, your goal is different. Why you? What is compared yourself with the other person? Okay? Simply you are going to the road. Other person just chased and he went to his home. You want to chase this person, he went to his home. You are laughing to the sir. Sir? I followed you. <laughs> Please tell me which area. You getting it? Yata Shakti. No need to compare, no need to chase anyone in our life. I only want to one point. I have seen many people. Many people in the home itself, the company itself, when you come back, when you have your competitor, your life is finished. You lose your peace. We can have a friendship with everybody. <coughs> friendship, affection, all that can help everything. No competitor. This is me, that's all. This, this is what the capacity Lord has given me. I cannot, can you memorize? No. Can you come to class? Yes. Can you sit one hour? One and a half hour also I can sit. Without sleep. That capacity I have. That shakti I have. But if you ask question, tomorrow I will not come. Question if you ask, you will be in risk. Simply, I will come and sit and I will listen. Tomorrow I will come. You are not asking any question. Yata shakti you have to live in this world. Don't do more than your shakti. That person is called a Pandita. See the highly practical points is telling. Okay. Therefore, we have given the topic how to lead successful, successful life. life. No need to have any competent. This I tell you, only one point you remove competent for your life. You are relaxed, no stress. Because you have you have competition, stress is there. Because you have to raise yourself. You have to do some exercise, all the things to complete this person. Why unnecessary? We eat very nice lunch, nice coffee, nice sleep, nice class for four days. Come at her and go. Nobody will ask any question. What did you learn in the four days? One day Lord knows. <laughs> <laughs> and some points I have to start. Okay? But lastly, we can live our life. So, the remaining shlokas tomorrow we'll see. Hmm? All very nice shlokas. And practical. It looks very simple, very effective. Simple, very, very effective. Not getting start, start up, not having any competitor. Okay, not revealing before execution. When you execute, the other things should not disturb. Simple, simple. Tomorrow will continue, okay? I hope tomorrow you will come, okay? <laughs> come tomorrow also. I have come from India. You have to come from this area. <laughs> Just one hour to hour. I know that one hour to hour is nothing. The road is very good. <laughs> nice to ride. For you only, it came here to come. Okay?
Maximum will work and it will be very nice, nice to work. Tomorrow it will be nice to work, so okay? Om Purnamadana Purnamidam Purnam Purnamadachate Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnamevam Sushate Om Shanti 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 Harihi Om Shri 